it, got it, got it. Okay. And you'll give it to this camera if you can. Okay. Ready? Yep, three, two. All right, so karate is an Olympic sport. I mean, within the sport, there are two events. What are those sports? Or what are those events? Come on. Uh, three, two, one. So karate is a new Olympic sport. And within that, there are two events. What are they? So the first one is called kata, where it's like a gymnastics flow routine. So you're showing your moves to the judges, and you're not really fighting somebody. So you're showing your moves, and you get points on how good your technique does. Wow, OK. And what's the other one? The other one is called kumite, where you're sparring with somebody, kind of like taekwondo, but you're using your karate moves on the other person. Wow, OK. So y'all just displayed both of those from your routine, right? I just seen a little bit of both. Because um, I've seen some floor exercise, and I've seen some fighting. Well, we didn't, we didn't do striking because that was in karate, but we did grappling a lot. Oh, that's like MMA. I mean, I mean, <laughs> grappling is MMA, right? Mixed martial arts? Uh, mixed yeah. martial arts is a combination of striking and grappling. Well, educate me then. I mean, right? <laughs> One thing about me, I love when someone teaches me how to learn. And that's what you just did. You just taught me how to learn. Snoop Dogg, the grappling was there. <laughs> so you didn't know either. You just sit over here getting free information. What are you talking about? I'm mean, just honest enough to tell the kids. What they, what they just did was put on display what I already knew. That was I mean, he does an arm bar. I mean, that's grappling. That's like, like I did say arm bar. We know that. I yeah. said arm bar. You just did after I said it. Come on, man. It's Ivy what he just did. He's talking about striking, but they can't strike here because then that would be wrong. Can you that's teach me one move? Come on, yeah. man. Can you teach me yeah. one move? This is a karate move, and it's called horse plant question, punching. So, how you do it is first you want to get your horse plant. Mm -hmm. So, how do I do that? you get your horse plant. You need to get your stance where your legs are. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you may not be able to do it with them. Uh, wait, what is it? Wait, he said a horse stance. Did he not just say a horse stance? Horse. Yeah. You're not riding, you, you're riding a horse. I need to stand next to you, show me. Like you're riding a horse. Oh, like I'm riding a horse. I thought you meant be a horse. He failed to write. He didn't have his money when it was time to pay in this class. So talk to me. I made it. So to get your horse stance, you want to get your legs and make them shoulder width apart. Almost. A bit more than shoulder. Yeah, a bit more than shoulder width apart. Shoulder width, Snoop? He don't listen. That's his problem. Okay. I brought my shoulders are wider than you. I'm where I'm supposed to be. Let's get it. Make sure me. And then you bend the little like this, like you're sitting on a horse. Uh huh. So that that just looks like you're punching. What's your problem? Are we here to attack? What are you doing? Me and I'm I get that, but are we here to attack me and my form? Or are we here to help? Okay. So how about we just show me the thing? Okay. Okay. <laughs> Both of your arms, and you're gonna put them not like a chicken, not like a chicken, but clock, 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 yeah, yeah, that's Hello. That was that was awful. Yeah. That was awful. That, that, was good. that was not good. That was, that was not. Good. Hey! Hey! No. Keep your fist. Keep I your opened fist. it up because I'm obviously Keep taking the blood out of his body. That's why. <laughs> blood! Go. No, no you're not gonna take blood. You're gonna get laid back on your back. You crazy. Dude. That's a that's in a, a puddle of blood. The court of blood <laughs> technique. That's what I just did. Okay, go ahead. What else? Is so that it? You you um you make your make your palm so it'll be facing down when you punch, but you also want to make a fist, so like this. You start with your right hand, punch, let's all do it together, come on, come on. Don't tell me what to do. <laughs> go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> Y'all not doing it right, but I'm saying my trainer. <laughs> my trainer, who you might not know, but who just so happens to be a master. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know if you guys know Doug. Yeah, who is he? A black His name is Doug Johnson, and he lives in Birmingham, Alabama. He's a third-degree black belt who's been training me for years virally. We do it through the internet. And Doug yeah, that's great training. Train. He can train over. The Doug field. tells me instead of doing yeah. ha, huh, he says yeah. keep it inside. Yeah. <laughs> I'm more of a slow attack. Don't be constipated again. I know you really want to let it out, but don't be constipated. What's your problem, man? Y'all come here for something else? Y'all came here for some action? Y'all can get what you want. Y'all can get what you want.
one. So if that's why y'all came here, tell me in a jacket. Oh. <laughs> Snoop, that's what I'm saying. See, they gave him a scout report. He didn't know. He was that bad nigga. <laughs> All right. Oh my God. Uh, first of all, guys, I gotta be honest, all jokes aside, 
I'm extremely impressed with your talent. Nine years old, and to speak the way you guys spoke today is extremely impressive, especially with the whole Bruce Lee breakdown and about how you are comparing it to a cup and you want to fill that cup up with knowledge and information. I'm blown away by that. I have absolutely no idea what you're saying. You want it. So after, after we break out of here, me and you, we're going to do it. We're going to do it. Of course, new record up. Me and little, me and little thug. Johnny. Well, uh, thanks for our show. Thanks for watching our show. Thanks to Rob River, the Twinges, and my partner in crime, Kevin Hart. Uh, yeah, and thanks to all the Olympians. Uh, and thank you to all the Olympians uh, representing the U.S. and Tokyo. We appreciate you guys. Hey, do what you're supposed to do. Bring home the. Go back. Let me do my thing. Hey, and thanks to all the Olympians. I'm sorry, Kev. I'm so sorry, because we won't be able to cut. So, from where? Okay, he's giving it to four. Do you want everything to three? Everything to four. Okay. That's going to kick. Who? Who? Snoop? Copy. Snoop, if you could go back from up to, yeah, and then come on down like you did. That'll help with our edit. Exactly. From right about there. And you guys give everything to four this time, because it did. Pose okay. with them. Kevin okay, Stegman. And ready now? Coming to Snoop in four, three, two. That's right, Joe. That's our show. We want to thank our special guest, Rob Riggle, and the Twinges. Twinges. And thanks to my partner in comedy, Kevin Hobbs. Yes, sir. Snoop, you're doing the damn thing on here, man. And hey, real quick, shout out to all the Olympians representing the U.S. and Tokyo. We appreciate you guys. Do what you're supposed to do. Bring home the gold and get home safe. Twinges, give me some, man. You guys are dope, and I mean that. Now, me and you, we got another problem. And after this, when the camera's off, no, no, not yet, not yet. Are the cameras off? Well, you got some nerve coming over here. <laughs> don't, don't take me down. Don't take me down. I don't want it. I don't want it. All right, man. Hey, we call us pussies on live TV. <laughs>